Hi everyone, it's Jennifer from Fiberflux. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing uh, Carnegie Hill. This is part of the Isaac Mizrahi craft line by Premier Yarn. I had the ability to work with this when I crocheted the Platinum Cowl. This is one of the free patterns I offer on the Fiberflux blog. And I do have a video tutorial for it as well. So I will link, link up this project. And I was shopping in the craft store and I came across this yarn and it really just caught my eye because of this beautiful um, soft silver with this um, kind of bronzy gold metallic thread kind of spun throughout. So it really caught my attention because it was a very pretty yarn. But to my surprise, um, sometimes these threads can be a little scratchy, but it does have an overall softness. You can definitely feel the thread when you touch it, but to me it doesn't feel scratchy. It, it, it is very wearable. Um, this here is called the Audubon colorway that I used for this cowl. And I have here another skein. This is called Merryweather, and it's kind of like a, a hot pink or deep raspberry sort of color, and it has some um, kind of burgundy and light blue th metallic thread woven throughout. So this is a really fun yarn to work with. And this cow here, I made with just one skein of this yarn. Um, each ball of this has 99 yards, and I was able to get a, uh, a complete cowl out of the yarn. So I was, I was um, very happy about that. I love one skein projects. Um, the content of this yarn is 67%. I'll pull this uh, label up a little bit closer so you can see is 67% acrylic, 31% polyester, and 2% metallic. Um, now they do recommend that you hand wash this yarn and lay flat to dry. So when you're purchasing, you might want to take the care instructions into consideration, especially if you are giving this um, as a gift, you know, to take that into consideration. A lot of people like uh, washable yarn. Some people are okay with special care instructions. And this is classified as a five or bulky yarn. And I'll show you just how the strands look. They're pretty smooth. You do have the occasional little loop here of this metallic thread. For the knitters out there, the recommended hook size is an eight millimeter set of knitting needles, um, also called US 11. And for the crocheters, you'll need a, the recommended hook size for that is a nine millimeter USM hook. So um, just take that into consideration when um, selecting this yarn. However, I used a different hook size for mine. And again, I'll provide the link to that pattern. And I got a nice kind of drapey open um, fabric from that. This yarn comes in lots of different colors. I have just two represented here in my review, but you can also get it in, um, I've seen some dark blues that are beautiful, like a navy blue with some kind of gold throughout, very elegant. So I really enjoyed using this yarn and I'm happy to share it with you. And that's it, that's all um, for my quick little review here. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helped inform you about this yarn a little bit more. And be sure and uh, click on the subscribe button to get all the latest Fiberflux video updates and more reviews. Thanks so much for watching.